السلام عليكم بناتو ميتس and welcome back to Yam Notes let me tell you the shoulder girder refers to the clavicle and the scapula as you can see here is the scapula on the back and, and that's the clavicle beside a bone here named the sternum now how these three bones are connected together that's right by joints on the meeting of the bones we have the sternoclavicular joint here between the sternum and the clavicle also the acromioclavicular joint here between the acromion of the scapula and the clavicle that's it as simple as that we have two bones in the shoulder girdle so we have two joints also you need to write this sentence after me each bone has an axis joint for example the clavicle moves over the axis of the sternoclavicular joint the easiest exa example of this is the humerus which moves over the shoulder joint anyway the sternoclavicular joint is joined by the sternum and the clavicle and its type is synovial saddle Synovial, as written in Yam notes, mean, means it's joined by articular capsule, as you can see here. Or you can say it has uh, egg yolk. Anyway, and saddle means its shape is like the saddle of the horse. This is the horse saddle if you don't know it. We finished the features, now the ligaments, which also needs a rule that we can make. Each joint has a similar name, ligament. What does this mean? Here, the, stenu, the sternoclavicular joint has a sternoclavicular ligament, but also has two uh, other extrinsic elements, the interclavicular ligament between the two clavicles and the costaclavicular ligament between the clavicle and the costa, meaning the cartilage of the first rib here. Write the new terminology always. Enter meaning between, costa meaning cartilage. And the two rules we have just made. Hello. Now for this next joint, the acromioclavicular joint, we need first to remember the scapula landmarks. Re returning to the previous chapter, Yam notes, we have the landmarks of the scapula here, and the shoulder girded bones, the crocoid process, which refers to this part here, and the acromion process is that part here. You need to know for our joint now. So our next joint here, the acromioclavicular joint, is, uh, joins the acromion of the scapula to the clavicle. And on the name of the joint, we have the acromioclavicular ligament. That's easy. And two other extrinsic ligaments. We have the coracoclavicular ligament between the coracoid process of the scapula. Sorry, this is the coracoacromial ligament. Yeah, I am sure you have noticed it. This is the crocoid process and this is the acromion. So this is the crocoacromial ligament. The third ligament here is called the crococlavicular ligament and is divided into two parts. One like a trapezium called trapezoid ligament and one is like a cone called conoid ligament. The, the suffix OID means light. So conoid ligament is a ligament like a cone. And same for the trapezoid. <laughs> Lastly is the scapulothoracic joint and it is a physiological joint made by muscles only. What does this mean? If you can clarify this point more, you can write it in the comments. How about we summarize in the Arabic language? حزام الكتف مكون من عضلتين الكلافيكال والسكابيلا وكأي عظمة في الكسر تحتاج إلى مفصل لتتحق... لتتحرك على محورها الكلافيكال تتحرك على محور الاسترنو كلافيكال جوين وهو المفصل بين عظمة الاسترنم والكلافيكال نوعه سينوبيا السادل وأربطته ثلاثة الاسترنو كلافيكال ليجمنت على اسم المفصل واثنين خارجيين الانتر كلافيكال ليجمنت بين الاثنين كلافيكالز والكوستا كلافيكال ليجمنت بين غضروف الدرع الأول والترقوة أي الكافيتل أما المفصل الآخر فهو الأكروميو كلافيكولار جوينت وهو الذي تتحرك عليه عظمة الاسكابيلا هو بين الأكروميون أوف اسكابيلا والكلافيكل ونوعه سينوفيال بلين وأربطته ثلاثة أيضا واحد على اسم الجوينت يسمى بالأكروميو كلافيكولار ليجمنت واثنين آخرين الكراكو أكروميون ليجمنت والكراكو كلافيكولار ليجمنت اما السكابلو ثراسيك جوينت فهو مفصل غير حقيقي مصنع بالعضلات ليس بين عظمتين ولكن بين عضلات وعظم هذه هي المفاصل الموجوده في الشولدر جيردل هاو اباوت وي هاف سام براكتس كويشنز ذا كلافيكال موفز اوفر ذا اكسس اوف وي هاف فور تشويسز هير ويل ذا انسر از ذا ستيرنو كلافيكولار جوينت اي تولد يو اوريدي Write down the ligaments of the acromioclavicular joint. You have three seconds to think about it. You know we have three, right? One, two, and three. One of them is on the name of the joint itself. 
it is the acromioclavicular ligament and two coraco one coraco clavicular ligament and the other coraco acromion ligament label the torn ligaments try to think about it you need to first label the bones this is the clavicle we have here the acromion it's part of the scapula and here is the crocoid now it's very much easy between the crocoid and the clavicle we have the crococlavicular ligament and between the crocoid and the acromion we have what hmm. the crocoacromion ligament how about uh, this last one can you label it write it in the comments our quote this time says on the tongue of uh, Dulkar 9 in the Quran he says اتوني زبر الحديد حتى اذا ساوى بين الصدفين قال انفخوا حتى اذا جعله نارا قال اتوني افرغ عليه قطرا which means uh, bring me bars of iron until when he had lived them between the two mountain walls he said blow with bellows until when he had made it like fire he said bring me that i may bore over it molten copper here we have the, uh, we have between the two clavicles the interclavicular ligament that's why i brought this verse it's a very good way to remember it an example here we have uh, the two mountain walls and between them a dam 